Buongiorno e benvenuti to this video explaining the numbers in Italian over a hundred. I'm Alice, Flynn and Three Months resident Italian, and today I'll teach you the hundreds, thousands, millions, and billions in Italian. If you dream of counting the stars in Italian, or of pretending that you're an aristocratic billionaire in Rome, I mean, who wouldn't want to? This video will help you learn the big numbers you need. Abbiamo mille cose da discutere, so let's get started. Well, we don't really have a million things to discuss, but it's a popular Italian idiom that kind of fits the context. So let's go. If you need a refresher of the numbers from zero to a hundred before we start, we'll link to our video on the topic in the description box. But now let's jump to the hundreds. Hundred in Italian is cento. To say a hundred, you don't need to put uno in front of cento. You just say cento. To form the other hundreds, you need to put the numbers from two to nine in front of cento. So here are all the hundreds. Cento, duecento, trecento, quattrocento, cinquecento, seicento, settecento, ottocento, novecento. Pretty simple, right? And to stack the numbers from 101 to 999, you just put together the hundreds, the tens, and the ones. So it goes like this. Cento trentanove. 485, 999. And after 999, it's time for the thousands. To say a thousand in Italian, you say mille. Now for all the thousands from 2000 up to 99,000, add the numbers from two to 99 in front of mila. So let's go over 1000 to 10,000. Mille, due mila, tre mila, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000, 8,000, 9,000, 10,000. And let's just have a look at a few examples above that. 23,000, 345,000, Now, to form the numbers in between the thousands, you just stack everything up together. 345,345. Now let's just pause for a second. Have you noticed how instead of using the commas to separate the thousands from the hundreds, we've used the periods? It's because in Italian, periods are used for numbers above zero and decimal numbers are written with a comma. So here's an example. 1111,1. And another note on writing. If the numbers get too big to write together in a single word, the separation is made where the period goes. So with the example above, it's 345.000, space, 345. Okay, now we're getting big because we're moving on to millions. Million in Italian is milione. Now to say a million, this time you do have to add the number one in front of milione. Except you don't say uno, because that just wouldn't sound correct. You say un milione. For two to 999 million, it works just like with the thousand. So let's practice a few millions together. Due milioni, quattrocento milioni. And then stacking gets very long, but the structure remains the same and it's very simple. 452 milioni, 452 mila, 452. Okay, last up on our list is billions. Billion in Italian is miliardo. And you can use it the exact same way you use milione. So, un miliardo, undici miliardi, cinquecento quarantasette miliardi. That's a lot. And unless you actually need to say the exact number, you can just use the word for infinity in Italian. Infinito. Whew. That was a tie, someone. Grazie mille for staying until the end. What are you going to count with these big numbers? Let me know in the comments. Before you go, please leave a thumbs up to let us know you appreciated the video. And if you want to stay up to date with all the language related content we post, just hit the subscribe button. I will now have to catch my breath. So I wish you all a very happy language learning. A presto.